welcome back to Airship Conquer the Skies, Frazier as always, and well, sorry, it's been a little while. There was some videos recorded, but they were kind of terrible because the thing kept crashing on me and it was a bit of back and forth. I've had some talk with the developers and talk with the lovely, I believe it's Vabis, uh, I don't know if I'm saying that right, about the mods and everything, and well, we've tried some different things. Hopefully it works this time. The only thing I can see that's kind of affecting it now is during when we're building, it tends to have a little bit of a stick when you're building, but other than that, it seems to work okay, and I'm using a sort of Java launch on it. But we'll soon see how that goes. Right now, there is actually a couple of mods I've added in. I've got extended plane and catalytic mod. The reason why I want to start a new game is because I want access to the planes. Because I want to build carriers, and I think that's going to be pretty damn cool. And the mod adds even more to that. So, we're going to do a new game. We are going to do medium. We're going to do it on a large map. And this is our core of arms, so we've got all cannons are twice as accurate, you've got aerial torpedoes, spider legs, and guillotine revolting city. So we have that in there. So let's uh, just do this, there we go, and let's begin. So yeah, I must admit there's going to be like a, an almost a soft reboot of this series, because this is just carrying on, because it's kind of... All our ships will be there, it will just be sort of a new world we're exploring, and things have been updated, and it's a lot more... Um, balanced, that's the word I was looking for. It is quite balanced in the way things are done now. So we'll soon see what that is. There's also giant bees in the game now, because why the hell not? And I've tried to take some of them on. There was actually a video I did to them, and they, they're, like, they literally just spawn thousands of bees, and it's a pain. But hopefully, with this, we end up being able to show you guys just a little bit more of what the airships offers. Hopefully we can get a few videos out of this, and we'll continue on and conquer the world. Anyway, this is our map here. I uh, still don't know what that flashing is. I can never get rid of it. Now, if we go into a design ship, let's uh, just open the designs. Now, the developer lovingly added the smashing, the HMS smashing. I kind of updated it and added a bit of redness to it, so that's really... The, literally the difference between it is just red but we have a, quite a few wee things here as you see bombs are here i've got whatever that is uh okay that was strange could i open that game is it possible to open that game no that game is now gone okay that i, I don't even know what happened there it literally just was like nope you cannot play the game anymore you're not allowed you're not allowed to play it anymore. But yeah, there's a lot of planes, and uh, as I was saying, the mod does add, like, bombers and uh, other planes, and basically you can create a carrier out of your planes, because in the main game, the better at the moment only adds planes that can go along, and then you've got one sort of hangar bound, bound below you can actually add, which has, like, buzzers, I think they are. Whereas in the mod, you've got planes you can add in, like, bomber planes up and down, and so on and so forth, and it creates a bit more... An extended thing of what you can and can't do, and I'm really, really looking forward to doing that. Because I did build a carrier, and I'll show you. I'll probably be making updates to it, though. So, right, okay, so we got this. So, let's design a ship. There we go. So, there we go, that. And we probably noticed that there we go. So, we got these guys here. This is these ones. And I have lowered the graphics capability down just to see if the game will hold off. Because I have been told by developers uh, the game kind of uses one gig of RAM. And if it reaches that, it tends to crash. We've also got these guys, which are bombing planes. We also have the inverted one. So you can actually do that if you want to and create some kind of cool little thing there. You've also got the triplane, which is this guy. And you've got mech dock as well, which are these guys. And you've also got the spawn tam thingy. Which I think what you can do is basically put them at the back and just launch them in. So you could create some pretty huge carrier with any luck. So let's leave that just now. And let's open a design. Let's open this guy. There we go. This is the Scottish carrier. Who I'm very impressed with it because I really really like it because he's got some of these on here basically too and it's got the enhancer as well which kind of because um, he does have quite a high server ceiling it's quite costly but pretty much it sits at the back fires multiple guns basically but these all are fantastic basically I had two of these in my fleet and they were just completely destroying stuff and it's so good but we're going to just leave that just now because we'll make updates to that when we can 
What do we want to do is how much money do we have? Not really that much. So let's carry on playing the game and see what is going to change in our world. Anybody doing anything right now? Nobody's doing it. What actually have I got? What the hell is that thing? Uh, right. That's not going to be useful, like, at all. The sheep needs more supply hatches. All right, the game, game doesn't even work. Oh, those two are finding out down here. Now, I might do, just keep it to, like, speed of one or two, because it seems to keep the game running better. Um, have we got enough money? Yeah, we do. Let's get some of these guys going, because... These guys are superior in every single way. Let's not take away anything. What have we got in defenses? Let's have a wee look. We do have that. We've got these guys. So this is generating some nice fun for us. Um, I believe that should possibly go to the front. So what if we uh, put that there, move you to there, and we'll move you behind. There we go. Does that actually save that? Did that save that? Yes, it did. All right. And then we just have to wait, well, of course, for some ships. Fire has called the foreign engine to destroy, has destroyed the iron fort at Smashed Obeer. You may need to strengthen your empire secret police. Uh, let's do, let's do up that to medium there. Actually, can we, how much would it cost us to take all the way up? Eh, not too much, okay, because we only have one empire at the moment. Now, these guys are being a bit of a, let's have a little look at some spies. Let's send on a spy there, because then we can try and see what they're building and also what they have. So, massive stone walls, great forest, grand keel. Let's have a wee look at your defense. Do you have that? Should I bribe you? Oh. I bribe you again? Oh. All right. That's all you have. That's uh, fair enough. Let's have a wee look at this. Uh, okay, there's not really much in the way. We could probably try and extend ourselves out, extend our reach, and then try and hold, because this is probably going to be the hold here. And the smash, or the smashing is almost done. And once we have that, because basically we'll need areas that we, oh my god, there's some war going on over there. Because we don't really have much in the way of, well, anything right now. I am going to scrap that, because that is useless. Uh, build ship. Let's uh, make it a no. Let's see. I could build a carrier now. <laughs> I could build a carrier, but I want to have three of these guys going up just now. So we'll build one of them, and what we'll do is we shit. Where are you guys going? You're coming up this way. Uh, okay. I'm just gonna hang tight and take you on then. What have you got? What have you got for me? Hmm. What have you got? Let's see. All right, so you got that, so how about we place you there? Start. What the? Oh, there's things up there. All right. Ow, son of a... Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay, withdraw. Ow. Ow. There's, there's barely anything of them left. Holy crap. So yeah, the, obviously you see the, the actual... Let's just actually make that. Um, main game. There we go. Save that. As you probably know, the graphics have been turned down just a little bit sort of thing because I don't want anything screwing up, as you've probably seen there. But we will uh, see what we can do. Now, I am going to need to... Oh, dear. Right, let's view that city now. It's got a couple of wee things there, a couple of wee things there. Review got... Oh, my. So you've got actually quite a wee bit there going on, so we want to make sure we're avoiding that. Let's speed this up. Hopefully it stays working for us. There we go. Oh, oh, okay. They've joined together. Wonderful. Great. Uh, oh, that's another thing being constructed down there. Let's uh, just pause that. Get a nice wee repair. So we're going to need two of them to... Oh my god. How many things are... See if that actually works. Plot to destroy it against them. Fine. Be that way. That is a lot of bloody units. All right, so, hmm. I mean, what we could do, though, is, like, because we have this, right? We want to actually, no, we don't want to build you. We want to design. And we're going to open that one because I want it to be what it is um, and, well, to have it looking pretty cool. So we've got the planes on top and we've got the planes on the bottom, but what I want to do is I want to see, like, where can this go? Does that, like, connect to there? No. Let's get rid of that just now. Right. As you probably know, there is a slight 
hang when you're you're sort of building but to be honest that's to be expected now we could actually place these all the way along that's a tripling buzzer bay you also have a buzzer bay as well i think what i might do is i might take these out and replace them with the buzzer bays maybe i mean we've got the light bomber plane which i don't know what are these ones doesn't want to let me there's the module What, what what one is that? Is that the light bomber plane? Don't think... No, it's not the light bomber plane. No. Uh, that's got to be light bomber. It's probably the trip plane. So we'll take that away. Let's get rid of that. Nope. Hey! There we go. Get rid of it. There we go. And we'll add the trip plane back. I mean... Can't place that on top of that. Because that one goes to there, then to there, then to there. And place you. There we go. Nope. See that? that Yeah, it's a trip plane. That's a trip plane. Okay, so we can also have trip planes underneath if we wish to. So you can actually have trip plane carrier if you wish to do so. Now, under here, we could get three of these sort of thing. Hmm, I'm wondering if we should. A launch module for a mech speeder, a faster version of the mech. I mean, that goes... Where does that... Where would that go? Because obviously we've got bits here, like, to keep the fire, because fire can easily break out here, but what I might do is take these all away, and I do have mech suits in here, and I don't know if they actually work or not. <laughs> I actually have no idea if they work or not, but... And you notice we've got uh, some repair bits in that here as well. Let's get that, that. And that. Right, now, do we want to put the planes in? Because do we want to have a plane here and here? I might. Or do we want to have bomber planes? I might want to put the bomber planes actually down below. There. And there. Is that what we want to do? I mean, that is accessible. Um, let's actually get rid of this. And this. And that. Because what we want to do is we want to put it, like, to here. I'm going to get rid of that one. And put that to there. And let's see. Light bomber plane. There we go. I mean, we could have it this way. Uh, we could have it the other way. It's up to ourselves, really. And let's get rid of that. Get rid of that. Hmm. Now, what I might do, actually, is switch this to be like that. And we just take this one out. And we still have the sort of fire point down in the middle. With a corridor on either side. This is what I mean by the game seems to stick, but to be honest, I can put up with a little bit of sticking if you guys are okay with putting up with that. In order to have, well, this... Um, work because it's it works otherwise F fighting as you saw runs at 60 fps everything else runs at 60 fps so it's just a case of building these and taking a little bit of time because i mean there we go slightly reduced size due to structural integrity now what i might do though is we've got four bombers we got one two three four five of them is i want this to be like a pretty beastly carrier so what i might do is do you want the buzzers or do you want because obviously you can have that no that one because we can essentially connect that all the way down there can do that if you want to uh, tadpill missile that launcher that deploys a pair of specialized tadpills that are more agile and capable of advanced set of maneuvers can either have that or we could have the mech dock. 
What does that look like? Now that, I believe, can go pretty much anywhere. So let's get rid of these. I know the ship's modules are not mutually connected. All right, so, I mean, because I want to have it something that in the way of, let's see, can I go there? No. Where do we put it? Where do we want to put it? Put it there. It doesn't want to go. No? It doesn't want to be placed because I think of that. It's kind of one of those things I'm wondering where to put these. I don't know what, I don't want to put them there so I don't want to make it bigger, but I want to make this maybe longer and maybe adjust all this to being back here. Put more of it. Um, Let's see. Wait, no, there is propellers on that. How is that staying afloat? How is that afloat again? I have no idea how this is actually... Because obviously it's suspendium chambers. It might be these. Generates propulsion. Oh, they, yeah, then. All right, so the enhancers do their job. So why don't we... Don't think I'll move them. What we'll do is maybe move the, the bracing. Let's get that just now. So we'll remove the bracing. There we go. Because what we'll do is we'll put the the buzzer things at the back. And there's a wee elevator here so people can get quickly to and from things, which is always good. Uh, let's see, where was um, the buzzer bay? Was it the buzzer bay? No, it wasn't the buzzer bay, but... I mean, no, nah, we don't want to have that. Because what we'll do is we'll do another carrier that's buzzer only. I think that'll be a better thing. It was a mech dock, I'm sure, actually, maybe. So, let's see. Mo uh, launch module for mech speeder, faster version of the mech. I mean, if we put that there and we put it there. I don't think you put one there. Yeah, put one there. One there. I mean, obviously, it's going to be a pretty lengthy beast, but, I mean, there we go. There we go. There we go. Right, now we also want to kind of connect it up. So, we do need some corridors. And we do need it to, hmm. Does that go on there? That's all red. So, I mean, if we want to... The enhancers. Where's that enhancer again? I need to search for that. Enhancer. There's a enhancer there. And... So what we're going to do is we want to place that. Because that gives us nine of them. So let's put that there. That there. That there. Because, I mean, that's going to... It uses up coal. So, let's get that there. Take that away. That away. Drag that back. Drag that back. Hey, what does that look like, actually, when you... Oh, hmm. Looks a bit odd. Probably need to bring something around there, then. Because I guess you need to keep that open. But... Don't know what module you're searching for, buddy. <laughs> Alright, so what we want to do... Oh, there's a death ray there. Um, let's see. What we want to do is connect this up here. And here. And then we want to get rid of that one. Stop searching for things it doesn't need to be searched for. And I'm going to then, how much do we need? In? We've got 89 recommended crew, and we have 120, so we get plenty there. Where is that? That's what I want again. I want to put it, does it go there? No. Put it there. And then what I want to do is decoupler, strut, no. What about this? Can I go there? 
So I don't know if that needs to stay open or not. I'm assuming it does. How's that for, yeah, modules? I'm wondering if we need to add more coal, though, because we have a lift of 175. Hmm, I might put a coal at the back here, just to give us a little bit more. Or do, do what's coal? Is there a large coal? No, there's small and large. All right, all right. Let's see what that looks like in decorative. There we go. I mean, that all links to that. And you might have seen what I've been doing here. Uh, that's the planes. Uh, slate we just... I um, think what we're going to need to do is we still need to add a little bit of structural integrity to it. Let's see. What's a berth? Camp broom. Nope, don't need that. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Any adjustment model will gain a boon to its integrity. So we're kind of just going to take this around so it kind of attaches up here and here and here and here. There we go. Oh, there there we go. Excellent. Excellent. And I think what we will do... No, actually, I don't think we want to put that on. So let's go to decoration because we do want to try and make sure... I need to get it off of that bloody search bar. There we go. Right, so why don't rounded... What the hell? And let's see, let's see, let's see. We want to paint this. Eh, go for that colour and fill. There we go. And then we'll do this here. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. There we go. <laughs> the new Scottish carrier. Oh, I love it. I love it. It costs an absolute fortune, but it's amazing. And yes, we want to save over that. And we want to build one of them. They're probably going to take an absolute decade to build. Yes, we do want to build that. That's going to take a very, very, very long time to actually build. Yeah, that's going to take a... Because we only have a medium shipper. I think the shipyards relate to how quickly things will get built. Um, we do have two of these guys. I mean, let's see what you've got. You have a little tank guy. So how about I invade you? Ah! To battle! Baby? Let's do this. All right. And you. And you. Start to fire. It's going to be nuts. You, you really... Yep, I figured you would do that. There we go. Right. And move you back up there. Let's see, view city, there's absolute, oh, no, you do have some things, let's pause that just now. They're heading down to there, so let's ju jump them in there. Oh, God, oh, dear, nope, they got to us before, we could even take it over, wonderful. Oh, hi, bold and whoever the hell you are. Flee! <laughs> I'm coming to fight, maybe. All right, so we got you, and we'll put you there, and we'll put you there, and attack! No, do not let them get behind you. Do not let them get behind you. What do you mean you need some ammo? You have ammo. There's ammo right there. Look, see, ammo, ammo things. Do you realize you go under them, you're gonna be bombed, right? All right. Don't believe me. Don't believe me. Oh, you're stuck. So drag them forward a little bit. Bye bye. Oh, there. He is wrecked. He is running away. <laughs> Can't turn either of these around right now. Come on. But that one's on fire, though, so. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Actually, move back the way. Dang, dang, get back here. <laughs> Bring him down and... Oh, all right. Standard. Next. <laughs> oh, dear. 
Wow. Uh, so yeah, our carrier is only halfway done, but the Scottish carrier is going to be awesome to show off. And let's see, you guys. Oh, so we got another alliance going on here. Let's see that the city's like. There's absolutely oh, no. There is a couple of things. What is that coming towards me? A pirate king? Mate. Whoa. Okay. And it looks like Jack Sparrow. Oh, this is going to hurt, isn't it? You guys ready for this? Oh, what is this going to be? Okay. What have we got? What have we got? What have we... Ooh, yikes. Would we even be able to handle that? Not entirely sure. Hmm. <clears throat> the hell is... Get out of there, guys. Get out of there. Hmm. Yeah, no, flee. I don't want anything happening to them, so let's bring them back up here. Our carrier's halfway done, though, so that's going to be pretty... Where the hell am I going? <laughs> Get back over there. We could potentially attack that, um, although we are missing a little chunk. We're missing our bomb base. Oh, Smash Toby is partly recovered from the war. Probably should have went with free smashings before we actually done any carriers, because that is a big, like a big investment. It'll be an... Uh, very good investment. I didn't realize it was... Is there any other... Like, any other things? we got ruins there. we got... No, no, ruins there. Alright, what we're going to do is just speed this up. There... Oh, oh dear. Oh my. Oh, okay. Okay, things are changing hands. I'm just sitting in the corner waiting on my turn. Ah, uh, come on, come on. As we have to take up... Pirate repels. Pirate, oh, well, that's a pirate king after all, so I didn't think he was going to... Do have a lot of money coming in, which is good, which is good. We do need to spend some of it, which involves us, you know, the carrier coming out so we can actually move out and take some places and have some carrier stuff. There is some stuff going on over there, which is a group of grands are hiding out here. Oh, great. Uh, right. Okay, the carrier is now complete. Yeah, there we go. Uh, repair you. There we go. Alright, so we have the carrier. Let's take the carrier for a spin. Let's take it and attack these guys. Hello. Oh my good heavens, this is so cool. I am going to let this go. Oh my god, look at it. And away they go. Why are they not launching? Launch. Oh, there, there we go. Whee. <laughs> Wait, are they? Which I don't even know. That is so cool! Oh, that is awesome. That is really, really awesome. No way they go! Attack! Woohoo! I might turn the graphics maybe back up, but we. There we go. That's smooshed. Woohoo! There we go, excellent. Let's uh, move you back here. Well, guys, that has been another episode of Airships Conquer the Skies. The Catalanism and the, well, the Extended Planes mods are in the game at the moment, so make sure you're checking them out in the Steam Workshop, and I shall see you all next time.